Hey there, everybody. How you doing? Welcome back to Airbrusher Games and Art. How you doing today? Well, here we go with some more World of Tanks. We got some more Price 9. He's platooned with McBosh. And both him and McBosh are running their Tier 10 IS-7s. Uh, a tank that I personally haven't had the pleasure of driving myself, but I've been able to commentate on Price 9 several times. <laughs> uh, but if you'll notice, Price has got a mark, mark of excellence on the barrel now, so he's been doing fairly good with this tank. So they're moving up here. Um, please enjoy this uh, beginning of the video of World of Tank Driving as they move into position here. They do move quite a distance before they see any uh, enemy. It's Normally when I'm on this map, I find them really quick. Usually a uh, first indication is when I get shot, but I guess that's neither here nor there. But as uh, McBosh moves into position and Price is right behind him, they're going to get into this kind of a weird little cat and mouse. Everybody's holding their position on the corner kind of, of game. The jousting starts though, but it, it, uh, it doesn't really get moving until later when uh, Mr. McBosh goes around the other side. But we'll see that in a moment. Here they're uh, just trying to work together. Uh, Price 9 has come up to support McBosh. And there's a uh, Patton up there and a little AMX that needs to die. Price seems to be pretty worried about that Patton. Though I think from the very front uh, it cannot pin him, at least with uh, any of his regular AP rounds. His, uh, HE might penetrate, but eh, we'll, we'll talk about that in a moment. Here Price uh, goes ahead and pushes up to get the shot. Kind of also test their resolve on the corner. See if they're really that interested in holding it or if they're going to move way off, you know, really back up. And there's the first real damage that Price has taken and it has the uh, Artie, of course. I think uh, Price may uh, may have uh, forgotten about the Artie for a moment there because he pulled out and kind of hung in that position for a second too long. But uh, like everybody else, he probably will not forget from now on. <laughs> we all know how Artie is. This is not armored warfare. They're not. Artie here is way overpowered in the damage they could do. But see, this is what I was talking about, this weird little cat and mouse game where they're holding the position. Uh, literally, Price can sit here and just hold this corner all by himself because uh, the IS-7 is ridiculously strong from the front, as you've seen. Um, the only damage he's taken has been from the arty. Everybody else is balanced or, had not, or has had non-penetration until the patent starts shooting uh, HE oh, rounds. Let's get this going. I'm actually kind of surprised that the HE, even though it's it's not getting full damage, it's it's getting some damage, some penetration into him. So I'm, I'm a little stunned by that. I, I thought that he would be getting nothing. But because the penetration is not good um, and these HE rounds comparatively like to an RD or something, these are tiny. So he's not losing any modules or um, or crew members. I think if the uh, and dead went to the uh, well one too many times there. Now that's what I was saying. The uh, that Patton is going to hold his position hiding. Uh, McBosh went south and has gone around the corner there. So there's a a. Waffenträger down there, the uh, Panzer IV version, and then uh, this T-54 here. And they put the herding on these guys. You can see uh, Price is taking, you know, five to six hundred a shot off on these guys. Gets a shot in here. There you go, dead. Uh, he's really relying on Russian accuracy there. 
Uh, and finally, the patent does full damage with its AP round. Uh, but you get a you know grew a set of uh, balls and drink some go juice. And here we go, boom. Just the sexual thrill! The sexual thrill! But of course now that the price line is turned back around, the patent has no go juice and no balls. So they're just hiding out there. They're gonna finish him up pretty quickly. There he goes. There's only a couple guys left. And Price Sign's gonna climb this mountain like a billy goat. But it's a very straightforward battle. I mean, nothing that uh, you guys aren't used to. It was just well executed. Um, showed a real good thing of uh, Price Nine holding a good tempo. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you, Price, for letting me know. Hope you uh, have a great day, folks.